Hey guys, it's Julie. Long time no see again. I just have problems doing videos, I think, anymore. It's been like, oh, I don't even know, forever since I've actually talked in a video or shown you guys anything. It's terrible. I know, life just like gets in the way all the time. But, uh, you know, things with my business are kind of in a really good spot right now. And I feel like I don't have to work 16 hours a day anymore. And I feel like, you know, the growth is kind of, <clears throat> you know, leveled off where it's even instead of like spiking. So I feel like I have time and I really want to get back to creating again. And, um, you know, when you don't create and you're a creative person, it really takes a toll on your mental capacity. <laughs> um, you know, even if you create for a living, you know, if you are, you know, you own a shop and, and you make things or whatever, you know, just creating for yourself is completely different. So anyway, today, because I really want to start getting back into crafting and, um, you know, doing things, I have a haul. And I haven't bought anything scrapbook related in um, seven, eight, nine months, maybe. So I took a little bit of my fun money and I bought some stuff. So I'm going to show you what I got. Um, I got some things from AliExpress. I got some things from Hobby Lobby, uh, and scrapbook.com and Simon Says Stamps. Okay. So let me show, I'm not going to tell you where I got it from because I don't have it like piled up that way right now, except for the AliExpress stuff, because that's like super easy to share. So I'm just going to show it to you. So the first thing that I got was uh, this first order here is from AliExpress and it's sequins because I have no sequins because I kind of miss a whole bunch of trends. So I never really kind of stockpiled any of that kind of stuff. So I bought some sequins and you know, I should know the sizes in millimeters, but I guess I just wasn't paying attention. But these are pretty big <laughs> uh, for sequins anyway, I thought. But they're um, cute little butterflies. Oops. So all different colors, pastels, of course. So And they're kind of iridescent. So I got a big bag of those. And um, I really don't know. There's 2,000 in here. And you know what? After thinking about this, I don't think I got these from AliExpress. I think I got these from Eight Seasons. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I got these from 8 Seasons because that looks like their tag. So then I got three bags of these because they, look at the shine, are super fabulous. And you guys can't see that because I just dumped them where the camera wasn't. Let's see. I think I'm going to have to move this down a little bit. Excuse my reach. There. Anyway, look at how gorgeous those are. They're super pretty. Super, super, super pretty. So I'm going to set those aside. So I got three bags of those because um, I guess I really wasn't paying attention to what, how many were in each one or whatever. Those butterflies had 2,000. There's, it says there's 50 in here, but I'm thinking more like 5,000 or 500 because there's definitely more than 50. Okay, so I got three bags of those. So I'm going to have to do some um, sharing, I think. Uh, there are 5,000 of these, and these are just some gold sequins. Just some pretty gold ones. And these are a little, these are probably 8 millimeter. Those other ones might be 10 millimeter. The size, anyway. Okay, and then I got silver, because you can't go wrong with gold and silver, right? So, I don't know where the camera is. There it is. Okay. Those are also, I think those are 8. They might, I think they're 8 millimeter. And then I also got these, which are tiny. These must be three millimeter. <clears throat> and uh, they're just super cute little stars. And of course, they're all pastels. Sequins stick to everything. They're like glitter. Okay, and then these are also, these are little flowers. And these are a little bit smaller than those stars. So I'm thinking these are probably, those might have been four and these are probably three millimeter, but these are cute. And since I, you know, here's another thing. Shaker cards, 
man, those are way back. When I first started scrapbooking, that was something that was like, you know, like in and, um, you know, everybody did those. And then they kind of fell from grace. And now all of a sudden they're back. I was like, yay, because I have a, I have quite a bit of stuff for those. So I'll have to pull out the archives, I think, to look at those. Okay, so let's do Hobby Lobby since I have it kind of right here. So you guys might not know this, but um, for the past three to four years, I've kind of sold jewelry supplies and um, custom vinyl things on my Etsy shop. And I also sold a lot on Top Hatter. I don't sell on Top Hatter anymore because it just was uh, insane. <laughs> um, so I don't do that anymore. But I do still sell on Etsy and I sell on Amazon Handmade. And I am clearing out all of my jewelry supplies. So anyway, I was just saying I don't have these. Like this isn't something that I, I carried. So I picked these up from Hobby Lobby. And they were on clearance. And they're just cute little cabochons. And uh, I think they're probably 18, no, they're 20 millimeter. And they're super cute, super sparkly. Ooh, there it is, super sparkly, kind of ombre looking. So I got those. I got what they had left. They had three packages, and they were $2 a piece. So probably could have got these for a lot less um, from one of my suppliers. But, you know, they had them there, so it was just convenience. Okay, so then just this past couple days ago... I went to Hobby Lobby and I looked through their clearance and of course had to get some things that everybody was getting. Um, but these were uh, liquid pearls and they were on sale for $4.19. And you got three bottles. I got the blue, like a green, and a purple color. It's super pretty. And then I don't have these. Uh, it was the mint color and the biscotti. So I got those too. Um, I have so many sprays still. I just have, I just don't know what to do with them all, but, um, you know, I kind of, I have a ton of Lindy Stamp Gang and none of the sprayers work on them anymore because it's been so long since I've used them. So I'm going to have to try and take them off and, um, maybe dump them in hot water or something and see if I can get them cleared out. Otherwise I'll just use it with a paintbrush, I guess. Um, okay. So what else? I got these because um, Paper Studio was all 50% off. These are super cute. They're tiny. They're probably, I think they're four millimeter and all in pastels, just the little rhinestones. And then I got some enamel dots. And then I got some sequins. And these are like the deep turquoise and the silver snowflake, I think. And then I got these, and they're like the dark red and the silver star. And then I got some more enamel dots. And then I got these cute little flowers, because um, you can't have enough flowers, right? And then I got this punch. It's the confetti punch, and I got it so that I could make... Um, stuff for shakers, you know, paper stuff for shakers. And then, of course, I had to get uh, these because everyone is getting them for bows and whatever else. So I got the turquoise, I got the pink, I got the gold, the faux leather, and then I also got this one. It's kind of gold, but it's kind of copper too, so I think it depends on what light you look in. Okay, so I got all of those. And is there something else in here? receipt okay and then from well I don't know where they're from I can't remember because my uh, fabulous friend Anna who's serenity creations now I think on YouTube I can't remember if that's yeah I think that's right um was talking about this paper pad this is the tales of you and me and I had to get it because it is so pretty I love it so much and it's um, Prima. So, so pretty. So I got the pad, the paper pad, and then I also got the little um, journaling note cards. So, super pretty. And then, because I am a space cadet sometimes, from... 
scrapbook.com, I ordered the My Mind's Eye On Trend collection. And I turned around and ordered some of the On Trend collection from Simon Says Stamps, too, because sometimes I am just a complete space cadet. So I got the stickers. I really like the gold accents on these. That's why I got it. And then I got the, like, the die cut set and the paper. And I'm not sure if this is new or not because, like I said, I don't, I haven't bought it in so long that I haven't bought paper and things. Sorry, I just bumped the camera. I haven't bought paper and stuff in so long, so I don't really know if this stuff is new or not. But I love the gold accents on this paper. So I picked it up. So now I have two of those. And then I got the um, cards. And then I also got the enamel dots. And I think that was, that was the whole collection, I think. Not the whole collection, but that was what I got of the whole collection. Okay, and then... Oh, I also got, I had gotten two of these too. So hopefully I can figure out a use for those. Okay, so then I also got the Hello Gorgeous um, My Mind Buy because that one is super duper pretty and I really liked it a lot. And here's another thing. I got the chipboard too from On Trend. I'm all scattered. I haven't made a video in so long like I, I can't get my thoughts processed right. Okay, so yeah, I think that's I really should have separated this out a little bit better. Okay. So then I got the Hello Gorgeous. Some of the Hello Gorgeous. I love these enamel dots. They're so pretty. And then I got the little die cuts and the cards, which I noticed that Hobby Lobby has these now too. But in my Hobby Lobby, these, the On Trends, are the Hello Gorgeous, and they have the On Trend too, um, is not by um, where you would think it was. It was by the Project Life stuff. And then I got the paper, because the paper is super, I, I, this was the first pad that I seen that I really, really liked. Okay, so I got the pad of paper, and then um, I got this stamp set, and I have no idea why, because I thought it was the one that went with that collection, but it's not. And this is Echo Park. It doesn't even match at all. So I got that. And then one other thing from Hobby Lobby, and I was really super surprised, because I went, I was there oh, a week ago when Spellbinders was on sale. And I was looking at their dies. Now, they had these small ones. This is like the clock, the smiley face, the world, and like the camera and adventure and the little compass thing and the globe. Well, all of the other packages except for these were marked $9.99. And all four of these were marked $4.99. So I don't know if I got a deal if they were mismarked or if the $9.99 ones were mismarked or what. But um, yeah, so I got those four because I thought for $4.99 you just don't see dyes really that cheap ever. Okay, so then I got Echo Park Happy Summer. And it is really cute. Kind of a fun bolder color and I got the ephemera pack and I got the enamel dots so now I think I'm pretty much set on <coughs> excuse me enamel dots okay so then I also got this is from scrapbook.com too I got the bow bunny so Ray collection and I think this might be an older one I'm not 100% sure like I said I haven't really searched for paper in a very 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 long time but this was pretty and it was on sale scrapbook.com had that on sale and then I also got the little I guess it's an ephemera pack and I think it goes with yeah the soiree collection and I guess it has paper I didn't realize it had paper in it so I got that and then I also got is it this one the stickers 
because they're super pretty and they come with an alphabet. And then from Simon Says Stamps, I think, I know I got these, and I think I got the Echo Park from Simon Says Stamps. So I got these, these just came out I think last week, or two weeks ago maybe, but this is for Mother's Day, for some Mother's Day cards. Oops, sorry about the glare. And then, oh, my battery's going to run out. Hold on just a minute. Okay, I have to hurry up because I, for some reason my battery's not charging on this camera. Okay, so I also picked up the Nautical Bliss by, it's going to be kind of hard just because I'm so far zoomed in. It's going to be kind of hard to see it all, but I got the Nautical Bliss by Julia Nutting, and that's the whole collection of 12x12. And then I also picked up this one. I know this one is kind of old, but it was so cute I had to get it, especially for summer. It's the Homegrown Collection, and I think it's um, Echo Park. So, yeah. Oh, and I got this, too. Um, this must have been from Hobby Lobby. A little congrats grad stamp. So that was my haul. So I hope to get back to crafting, like, right away. Like, I want to make something right now. Um, thanks for watching everybody. I hope that you will um, like and subscribe and we'll have some more videos for you guys really soon. Bye-bye.